action. Greg Cock here at NAM 2013 at the Paul Reed Smith Lair, if Sanctuary. you will. If you will. Yeah. And I'm here with the mighty David Grissom, one of my favorite axe wielders and a hell of a nice fellow. What's going on, David? What's going on with your NAM experience? Well, my NAM experience this year is very low key. Uh, I'm doing some demos up here now that Paul is sort of moved up. He's not on the ground floor. We have the, the uh, two demo rooms here, so it's chilled out. And um, it's it's uh, five till twelve, and I'm done. You gotta I'm love exhausted. that. I'm exhausted. <laughs> <laughs> no. Well, it's got to be nice being up here because down on the floor, it's yeah, like, I know, I know. It's, it's like a sea of cool. mutantry. It's, Not that it, I'm judging. Mike. No, I I, I I I like it. But even up here, you get a, a nice dose of fishnet hose yes and uh dot jet black hair a lot of people holding on to the dream it's the 80s live here at now indeed they do the skullet is also a bold hairstyle now i've been having the good pleasure of wielding many of your savage axes out of the wildwood lair and i got to tell you that is one ergonomically satisfying and aesthetically pleasing axe so you're having fun playing these rascals still i would imagine yeah i can't i, I mean i'm uh I think I, I'm destined to play them forever. Yes. Uh, yeah, I mean, the guitar was 25, you know, it's basically, I've been with PRS for 27 years, and uh, Paul and I have talked building guitars the whole time, so really the guitar took, you know, it came about five years ago, so it's 20-something you know, years in the making, and it really did, it didn't come that way by accident. It's really, a, you know, thousands of gigs and hundreds of sessions that uh, resulted in every little fine point of that guitar. And I mean, it, we I meticulously spec out every point, right. fine point of the guitar. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm glad you dig it because- It's glorious. It's coming from you, that's high praise. Well, thank you kindly. It's been fun playing them. Every time I get one, I was like, eh, I'd like to nab one of these rascals. Yeah. You well, know, we can work that out. I mean, well. I, I imagine you know a guy. I do. Excellent. I know a cat who knows the cat. <laughs> <laughs> now tell us what you're doing playing-wise. You're doing some, got a house gig down in uh, Yeah, I've Austin. got I've got my band together now, and I'm, I'm super uh, excited about that. And it's been a long time coming. We've been playing for, for a little over a year now, and it's really got, uh, we've got a great rapport. It's a band, a true band. It's not just, you know, Sub. This guy subs for that guy. It's pretty. Right. It's really. Uh, it's really satisfying. So you I mean, get that I'm, chemistry going. Yeah, man. And we can go. Every every gig is totally different. You know what I'm talking about. And you know we stretch out a lot. Um, Austin is a great place to do that. The cre the the people that come to the gigs are really uh, respond well to that. And uh, especially playing every week. You know you don't want to play the same set. So right. we mix it up a lot. And I'm getting ready to start my fourth CD. I'm almost done writing uh, the tunes, and uh, it's going. I really want to use my band on it, make it a band record. Sure. So I'm doing that. Um, gonna do some. I got a bunch of other sessions. I'm gonna do a song for a Lil George tribute record. Oh. And I'm gonna do some dates with the Dixie Chicks this summer. And um, what else? You know, I still play with Joe Ely on occasion, right. but you know, really, mainly I'm focusing on my thing, which is so, uh, it just seems to be the right time to do that. It sounds glorious. It's, once you do it, it's like, once I've done this, it's very hard for me to, uh, I mean, I don't want to let it go. No, I hear you. Yeah. It's fun to unleash, un unmitigated and unexpurgated unleashing. We had a nice conversation about this, and I know you're up to the same thing, so. Yes. It's fun. We come to that point if we're lucky. <laughs> exactly. Where people actually we care to, about our thing. People care and we get to do it. So yep, exactly. It's a, it's a privilege. Well, a pleasure hanging with you as usual. Good to see you. It's good to see you. And hopefully uh, we'll do something together soon, causing trouble somewhere. And can we get some custard? Yeah, frozen custard. Yeah, Beautiful I'm, Milwaukee, I'm, Wisconsin. I'm, Nothing yeah. like it, folks. Yes, we, we feast. We feed, Wherever we go, we feast. Indeed. That's important. It is very important. That's all we got left, let's be honest. Well, it's true. It's true. <laughs> I know. It's, it's like I'm thinking. What else is there? Coffee. Which, Coffee and speaking food. of which, can we, can we, can we, would that be a, the next? Exactly. Yeah. Our next avenue of We're attack. We're going there next. All right. <laughs> All right. Thanks a lot. Greg Cock here. Wildwood Vision. We'll see you cats later.